minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. The liftoff of SpaceX 7 Starship test went off smoothly from the launch pad in Texas. It was the first such test this year and the mission was expected to debut a key satellite deployment demonstration. But eight minutes after liftoff, SpaceX Mission Control lost contact with the newly upgraded Starship that carried its first test payload of mock satellites, but no crew. Eyewitness footage showed fiery debris falling over the skies of Turks and Caicos Islands after the rocket exploded during its test flight. Dozens of commercial flights were diverted to other airports or altered course to avoid potential debris. The Starship upper stage, which was about 7 feet taller than previous versions, was a new generation ship with significant upgrades. It was due to make a controlled splashdown in the Indian Ocean roughly an hour after its launch. The last time a Starship upper stage failed was in March last year, as it was re-entering Earth's atmosphere. This time, orange balls of light flying across the sky were seen on over the Haitian capital of Port-au-Prince, leaving a trail of smoke behind. We did lose all communications with the ship, um, so I mean that is essentially telling us that we had an anomaly with, with that upper stage. Um, so we were just coming up to the end of that ascent burn for the ship uh, when we stopped until, or when we um, started to lose uh, a couple of the engines, we saw those dropping out and then we did lose uh, telemetry from the ship. So that means we didn't have contact with it. So at this point, we are assuming that the ship has been lost. SpaceX founder Elon Musk said a preliminary assessment showed an internal leak of liquid oxygen fuel led to the rocket's breakup. Musk plans to launch at least 12 Starship tests this year depending on how quickly SpaceX can implement fixes and whether the FAA opens a mishap investigation. Nothing so far suggests pushing the next launch past next month, he said. This was the redeeming feature of the seventh test launch. The towering Super Heavy booster returned to its launch pad roughly seven minutes after liftoff as planned. It slowed down and hooked itself on giant mechanical arms fixed to a launch star. The landing success was SpaceX's second in three attempts.